Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, parents and friends of the graduating class of 2020. This afternoon, we have assembled for our 68th and first virtual commencement exercise. This is a virtual setting where our students now become graduates by walking across their unique stage, receiving their virtual diploma, and going from high school to a new beginning of lifelong learning. Ladies and gentlemen, I hereby call this commencement ceremony to order. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. It is my pleasure to introduce Mr. Hunter Hayward, Senior Class President, who will lead us in the pledge. Hi everybody, Hunter Hayward here, Senior Class President. I'd like everybody to join me in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Welcome, graduates and supporters of the class of 2020. I would like to begin this afternoon ceremony with the introductions of our virtual guests, Ms. Christy B. Kinsella, Henrico County School Board, Brooklyn District. Mr. Daniel J. Schmidt, Henrico County Board of Supervisors, Brooklyn District. Dr. Amy Cashwell, Superintendent of Henrico County Public Schools, Dr. Michael A. Jackson, Principal of Hermitage High School, and Mr. Tyler S. League, Associate Principal. Ms. Cecily C. Gardner, Assistant Principal, Mrs. Amanda R. Mallard, Assistant Principal, and Mrs. Stacy M. Palkovic, Assistant Principal. Mrs. Deja A. Chappelle, Director of School Counseling, Mr. W. Scott Moore, Social Studies Teacher at Hermitage High School, Mr. Pierce Chancy, Class of 2020, Ms. Abby Wilhelm, Class of 2020, Mr. Hunter Hayward, Senior Class President, and myself, Marcellus Northington, 2020's SEA President. We will now have greetings from our school board, board of supervisors, and superintendent. Seniors, today is your day. Only you know what it really took to go from kindergarten to this moment. You have made your marks and the future is yours. You can be proud in knowing that today, you are a graduate of Henrico County Public Schools. As you begin the next part of your journey, I would like to give you three things to remember. Number one, be that person, the person who is not afraid to ask a question. The person who uses one's voice and remembers you can make a difference for yourself and for others. And the person who listens to the voice inside your head that says, you can do it. Number two, be kind. Remember, bad manners are never funny. Something as simple as a smile can mean more than all the words that could have been said. And kindness comes back to you in unimaginable ways. Number three, know the value of relationships. You will need your family, a support system, or a true friend to help you through the tough times. And be open to making new connections, but continue to value the ones you have. You will meet people who possess amazing talents and gifts, so take the opportunity to learn from those around you. In closing, I encourage you to find the will to rise to the challenges of each new day, knowing that some days will be harder than others. And as you take those next steps, remember the inspirational words of Winston Churchill who once told the world, kites rise highest against the wind, not with it. Congratulations, Hermitage, class of 2020. Hello, graduates. I'd like to share two things with you today. The first one's easy, congrats. This accomplishment is a significant achievement in your life and one that you should be proud of. I can assure you, your parents, your family, your friends, teachers at school, staff at school, and your entire community are proud of you. My second message today is this. Some may say that this year was difficult or unusual for you. They're probably right. Some may say that this year was unfair or that you might have faced adversity. They too are probably right. Here's my ask. Don't ever use adversity as a crutch or an excuse. Don't ever let an obstacle or a difficulty stand in your way or slow you down. Instead, use it. And if you don't believe me, here's proof, and it occurred right in front of your eyes. 
A few years ago, the 2018 UVA men's basketball team was ranked number one in the country, and they had just lost to a 16 seed in the NCAA tournament for the first time in history. The coach after the game could have used any excuse as a crutch, but he didn't. And instead he said this, and I'll quote, if you learn to use it right, the adversity, it will buy you a ticket to a place that you couldn't have gone any other way. Their ticket, an NCAA title 12 months later. Their bonus, due to the adversity that you have just seen, they're still champs today, so they got a two-year deal out of it. I will offer this. Use this year's adversity to make you stronger and punch your ticket to places that you couldn't have gone any other way. Congratulations. We are all now in your corner. Go be great. Thank you. Good afternoon to the graduates and families of Hermitage High School. I'm Amy Cashwell, Superintendent of Henrico County Public Schools. Graduates, I know you feel as if you've run a long race and just as the finish line came into sight, the world turned upside down. Sometimes it's been disorienting. Traditions are important and yours have been interrupted. But please know that you became a very special class of Panthers even before the events of this spring. As for the pandemic, you became special not because of what you faced as a class, but because of the maturity you have shown in responding to it. Living in a society means each of us must do hard things to keep our community safe. In doing so right now, you might feel your senior year was somehow less real, and I get that, but your growth your accomplishments and the bonds you've formed with one another are definitely real and they will last a lifetime. As we've been reminded, life is unpredictable. It's filled with unanticipated detours, heartbreak and joy. But as you move on to college, the military or the workforce, I hope you know that you are ready. You're armed with strength and a hard earned resiliency. I couldn't be prouder. Congratulations to the Hermitage High School class of 2020. Our students have arrived today due in no small part to the tireless efforts of our very special group of educators who comprise the Hermitage High School faculty. The members of our faculty have not only been teachers, but counselors, coaches, confidants, role models, and supporters of our students, both in and out of the classroom. Ladies and gentlemen, Please join me in recognizing the best teachers anywhere, the Hermitage High School faculty. Congratulations to the class of 2020. This day should be celebrated by the family, friends, community members, and teachers. Let's reflect on our journey, specifically the daily mornings at the Herm. Envision yourself walking down the aisles on the way to the first period as the 855 bell sounds. Teachers welcome you in the morning, and on Fridays, you may get to dance with Miss Jones in the hallway as she played music from her portable speaker. Sometimes I cannot tell who was more excited about Friday at the Herm, the students or the staff, but the nurturing family feel on our campus cannot be replaced. Shortly after the 9 a.m. bell sounds, and as we conveniently get our last fist bumps, handshakes, and hugs in, you would hear that familiar voice from our Director of Student Activities, Mr. Rollison, in his gruff tone say, Good morning, Panthers. It's Friday at the Herm. After a moment of silence and Pledge of Allegiance, he then directed us to tune in to Herm TV, our student-led television station. Before Hunter or Samantha would say a word, a special subliminal message was embedded in everyone daily. No. I'm not talking about when I stop by your classrooms every day, but the morning message from Herm TV, the intro, not the announcement, but the first song. Thanks to Mr. Healy and our tremendous Herm TV student staff, we began every one of your 122 days of your senior year with the following lyrics. I'm living in the 21st century, doing something mean to it. Do it better than anybody you ever seen do it. Screams from the haters, got a nice ring to it. I guess every superhero need his theme music. No one man should have all that power. The clock's ticking, I just count the hours. Stop tripping, I'm tripping off the power. 
The official title of the song, Power, was written by Mr. Kanye Omari West, released in May of 2010. It was nominated for a Grammy the following year and rose to number 22 on the Billboard Top 100. Prior to the nomination, it was reported that West spent an amazing 5,000 hours writing this song. Interestingly enough, Mr. West also had 16 additional writers to assist him with the track while he was in isolation in Hawaii. When asked about the development of this song, West stated, I didn't write my raps down for the first four albums. I did it straight from the head in the booth. But on my last album, I wrote it. I really put myself in the zone so that my life was dependent on the success of this album. No one man should have all that power. It's worded in a sensitive way that opens it up for everyone. Even if I use the first person and say, I, it's always for everyone. This is a very interesting song choice, and you can imagine my extreme surprise when I walked through the halls during my first day as principal at HHS. I asked, which teacher is blasting Kanye in the morning? Only to find out it was our daily announcements. But the message is succinct, and I thank Herm TV staff for articulating the vision for the class 2020. No one class should have all that power. But after what this class has been through, you clearly have what it takes to live in the 21st century and the power to thrive. Let me remind our listening audience what the majority of our 410 graduates were born in the shadows of uncertainty as our country learned to live in a new normal, adjusting to various safety and security measures in 2001. Our current seniors began school and experienced natural disasters, such as Hurricanes Isabel in 03, Gaston in 04, Ernesto in 06, Sandy in 12, Matthew in 16, and countless winter storms that impacted our connection and instruction, not to mention that tornado scare in 2019. Our seniors also missed the final day of school during their eighth grade year and could not close out their middle school career. Our seniors went through uncertainty of high school as multiple adults and coaches transitioned in and out of campus, which led to inconsistent expectations. And last but certainly not least, our seniors lost the ability to attend prom, participate in clubs, spring sports, sign the senior wall, and celebrate at the Siegel Center. Yes, you missed the final 58 days of your senior year. You missed so much, yet you are still here. And you still have the power. You did not let this break you. Alicia Keys would say, stay tuned. There's more to see. We're unbreakable. Kelly Clarkson and Janelle Monet would say, show them who you are and show them that you're strong. You are what you always will be, unbreakable. Chrisette Michelle says, you can keep on trying, but you can't break a diamond. And Lil Wayne would say, you cannot break down what can't be broken. You are not only unbreakable, but you persevere and you thrive. Over 200 seniors maintained AB honor roll and over 100 earned straight A's for this year, not to mention the hundreds of thousands of dollars of scholarship money for college. The class of 2020 is, is beyond compare and unbreakable. Your dedication brought you to this point in your life, but as this chapter closes, it's time to begin another. Whether you are entering college, enlisting in the military, or beginning the workforce, remember the attributes that brought you to this point. You have the power and you're unbreakable. You face challenges and disappointments. You have the power and you're unbreakable. You do not get to go to have that senior picnic. You do not have a formal graduation, but you made the best of every situation. You adapted quickly to our new normal and led by obtaining employment within our community. You have the power and you are unbreakable. You continue to persevere and thrive as Panthers should. No one class should have all that power. But you did require the assistance of others. Graduates, I encourage you to look to your left, look to your right, or look above, and thank the family members who supported you to this point in your life. Thank them for the help with the homework, school supplies purchased, rides to and from school, picking you up from clubs, games, meets, and practices. To our proud Panther Nation parents, 
I thank you for believing in our staff, for supporting us. Stand tall today as we cherish this experience for a lifetime. Finally, it is my extreme pleasure to officially welcome you to the family of proud Hermitage High School graduates. This is truly an honor from one Panther to another. As a 96 graduate, this is a group that I'm proud to welcome to the alumni. Class of 2020, the time is now. Now, my advice to you, when life puts you in tough situations, again, don't say why me, say try me. You prove that you are up for any challenge. You have the power and you are unbreakable. Now go and make the Panther Nation proud. Roll pride. As a class, I think that we've come pretty far. We started out by missing the last day of school, our eighth grade year. But look at us now. We are missing the entire last marking period of our senior year. If that's not progress, then I don't know what is. But in all seriousness, my life with you guys over the past four years has been a blast. I never would have thought that the shy and awkward kid I was in middle school would come to be the person I am today. And that's really all thanks to my fellow classmates. Whether it was an invitation to sit with them at lunch, or giving me a small nod as I passed by them in the hallway, I always felt like we had this mutual understanding and respect for one another. And I really appreciated that. But that's not what made our class unique. What made the class of 2020 unique was our strength and independence. We knew that the world wasn't going to change for us, so we put it in our own hands to shape our own futures. Do you remember how we won every single homecoming game throughout our entire high school careers, even though people kept saying that we'd lose? Do you remember how in 2018 we walked out of school on March 14th to protest gun violence in the United States? Or maybe you remember how we got quarantined in our senior year, but we fought through it and we were able to come out on the other side strong. Well, maybe that last part hasn't happened yet. But I'm sure that with a class as great as this, it will. Because despite all the obstacles that have been in our path before, we've overcome them. Despite the world seeming to always be against us, we've powered through with a smile on our faces. So thank you guys for being such an amazing group of people to get to know for these past four years. And I wish you guys luck on your life after homage. Thank you. Friends, peers, teachers, administrators, and parents, welcome. It is indeed a privilege and an honor to speak before you today. I want to thank Hermitage High School for being my home for the past four years. I will dearly miss walking through the halls, studying the murals, stepping on the red and blue floor tiles, looking out onto the courtyard, admiring the projects displayed in the glass cases, but most especially being around people who created an environment of growth and acceptance. Seniors, I'm not here to tell you that you should be grateful for the experiences that COVID-19 has brought along, that it could be so much worse, that it will teach you how to handle hardship in the future, that you will be better people because of it. Our generation is being personally affected by the events of a global tragedy. That makes us stronger, that makes us special. I want you to remember this when someone says our generation is obsessed with social media. Connecting with others on a global scale and knowing that we were all in it together helped us through these times. I want you to remember this when someone says you and your friends can't take anything seriously. Humor reminds us that happiness will always be there. I want you to remember this when someone says your expectations are too high and you should come back down to earth. Stay in the clouds. Stay vibrant. Stay hopeful. Unconventional thinking is what solves problems. And with our skills of adaptation, we will change lives. As youth, we see the future with bright eyes. However, this hope has been altered. We are mourning the loss of our traditional senior year that others around us have received. Some of us have even lost loved ones or have had loved ones risk their lives in their essential jobs. I urge you not to replace your sense of hope for the future with dread. I urge you not to lower your expectations so as not to be hurt and disappointed. I urge you to keep your aspirations high because you deserve so much. You deserve to be able to sit in a lecture room filled with 300 students. 
You deserve to be able to walk into the job market with an abundance of opportunities and choices. You deserve to be able to train with your colleagues to protect and serve our country. You deserve so much. Keep the disappointment you feel now and use it as motivation. Use it as a reason to keep trying. Use it as a goal. You have all sacrificed so much and deserve the world because of it. While we have given up quite a lot, don't let these unprecedented and depressing times keep you from striking out and making a place in this world where you feel truly happy. I know it may be hard to look towards the future with all the unknowns and hurdles to come, but don't let that make you give up on your goals. I know it may be hard to look back on the past because your high school years seem overshadowed by the events of COVID-19, but don't let those memories go to waste. The memories you made within the halls of Hermitage are your foundation. You learned how to make lasting friendships. You learned how to create a network of helping hands. You learned how to be comfortable in a professional setting. You learned how to balance your time between work and play. You learned what you were good at and what you want to continue doing into adulthood. And you are good at something, even if you haven't found it yet. Through the events of COVID-19, you have shown that you are resilient and strong. I would like to thank the faculty for being so enthusiastic about teaching that I couldn't help but care. You helped me discover what I loved learning about and how to become a better person in the classroom and out. Thank you Humanity Center for giving me the most extraordinary support system. You really were a home away from home and I couldn't thank you enough. Thank you staff and maintenance departments for keeping Hermitage a safe learning environment. Thank you administrators for coordinating and planning events to aid us in our education. Thank you parents for pushing us and sacrificing so much for us. We wouldn't be here without you. And most of all graduates, thank yourselves. Someone can be given all the help in the world, but it wouldn't matter if that person didn't put in every effort, every step of the way. You did the best you could have under your circumstances and you came out on top. You did it, we did it, we graduated. Thank you, class of 2020. Candidates for graduation, families and friends, by virtue of the authority vested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia, the Henrico County School Board, and on the recommendation of the faculty and administration, I declare these candidates of Hermitage High School graduates with all rights, privileges, and responsibilities appertaining thereto. Graduates, you may turn your tassels. Parents, friends, and guests, normally I would say we are excited about this time, but please hold your applause until you hear all names called. <laughs> However, for the unbreakable class of 2020, I hope that you dance, scream, and shout for your graduate as long as you want. Congratulations. Congratulations to the Hermitage High class of 2020. Ehab Abdallah. William Adair, Deep Agony, Selvin Aguilar Mendoza, Sarah Al Rabay, Mahmoud Al Hassani, Erica Ailman, Jaden Alexander, Zane Almadover, Samuel Aimdecker, Janiah. Ankrum, Jade Anderson, Ryan Andrews, Helen Angel Perez, Joshua Antoine, Theophilus Apaya, Maya Avin, Jason Ayala, Jacqueline Ayala, Tediana Ayinda, Natneel Behebru, Irene Bailey, Sharita Bailey, Mackenzie Barnes, Ethan Barrett, Edward Bates, Dayani Bayman, Ashanti Beard, Jeffrey Beardsley, 
Thomas Benton, Kiana Bathia, Reginald Blizzard, Alana Blosser, Kalanji Blunt, Taylor Blue, Royal Booker, John Bowman, Derek Boyd, Demario Bridges, William Brooks, Chelsea Brooks Giles, Ayanna Brown, Ryan Bruce, Shelby Brush, Alexander Bryan, Jada Bryan, James Burchett, Lamar Burrell, Caroline Burroughs, Jalicia Butts, Marquise Birdsong, Sierra Monet Catlett, Wesley Callahan, Cecilia Kano, Christopher Coulton, Jordan Carter, Minari Carter, Miles Carter, Daryl Kassan, Ricardo Castaneda Gomez, Kristen Serrato Saniga, Pierce Chancy, Latuan Cherry, Abriana Cleckley, Sarah Clemens, Zachary Coleman, Brandon Coles, Deshaun Coles, Sania Colon, Shadanya Renasia Coppage, Nicole Cornejo Artiega, Lucas Costa, Caitlin Cousins, Latanya Curry, Parker Cutright, Davian Dabney, Ella Daniels, Kelvin Darquois, Aaron Davis, Micah Day, Cecilia DC, Christian Viserys, Ayush Dakal, Vanessa Diaz, Montel Dobson, Lindsay Dodson, Jacob Dovell, Shane Dowdy, Kiera Duggar, Peyton Dunn, Faith Durfee, Anthony Edgell, Brooke Edwards, Charles Elmore, Juanita Evans, Kalia Evans, Royal Evans, Cynthia Falk, Devon Ferguson, Fatima Ferguson, Deshana Fields, Keon Fields, Sydney Fleischman, William Forrester, McKennedy Fuller Jones, Jordan Gaines, Karan Gales, Samantha Gaines, Justina Gamil, Tatiana Gardner, Joshua Garland, Xavier Garland, Alexis Geisler, Rachel Gentry, Cameron Gilliard, Desiree Glasgow, Aliyah Glover, Braulio Gonanez, Elias Gomez, Erica Gonzalez Martinez, Imani Good, Devon Gordon, Jonas Grant, Tejan Gray, Sierra Green, Brianna Greeson, Vanessa Gunter, Babas Guram, Zulix Guram, Nafisa Hafid, Jordan Hall, Alexander Halpern, Aradia Hamilton, Shavar Harris, Darius Harrison, 
Uma Banain Hashimi, Trinity Haskins, Isaiah Hatcher Aviles, Hunter Hayward, Tishaya Hearn, Antonio Highskill, Chandler Henderson, Melissa Hernandez, Taylor Malcolm Henson, Kyra Hooper, Forrest Horst, Hannah Hutkins, Keyshawn Hudson, Tyler Hughes, Anna Hurtado, Michael Hume, Dayon Jackson, Julius Jackson, Natalia James, Jade Jenkins, Aaron Jimenez, Chloe Johnson, Jaleel Johnson, Janiah Johnson, Anaya Jones, Janae Jones, Shania Jones, Jamari Jones Quarles, Amir Jordan, Ayana Joyner, Philip Camper, Maxwell Cates Tate, Mumta Katka, Hannah King, Jayshawn King, Emily Kohler, Samantha Cruzy, Madeline Landa, Gideon Langford, Pierre Larcher, Johans Eric Lee, Dakota Lemansky, Dominic Lamaris, Julia Leonardi, Granville Lewis, Jasper Lewis, Taylor Lewis, Gabriel Lira Comanero, Casey Long, Colin Lord, Kenny Luke, Nia Lyle, Terry Maeve, Joshua Macon, Layla Maduzia, Michael Major, Aaliyah Malcolm, Timothy Mallory, Timothy Manfredi, Paulo Marentes, Adriana Marston, Brian Martinez Jordan, Joshua Martinez Jordan, David Martz, Darnell Mason, Sierra Matthews, Mary Mattingly, Nathan Mattingly, Alexis Malik, Caleb Mazuko, Kinsey Mazuko, Chloe McPherson, Imani Meekins, Anthony Sean Mello, Dylan Melton, Dehan Mercer, Donna Mercurio, Jada Miller, Shahid Mills, Leah Mercury Stokes, Alexia Mitchell, Demetrius Mitchell, Kareem Modesto, Graciela Montesino Rivera, Andres Montiel, Brenna Mikhail Moore, Emmy Moore, Jalen Moore, Maxwell Moore, Miriam Moreno Alcala, Jarrell Morris, Leslie Moya Cruz, Kayla Mullinex, Eliana Nachman, Jordan Neville, Benjamin Newton, John Thomas Newton, Aliyah Nigro, Jashante Noel, Marcellus Northington Winston, 
Joshua Norwood, Anthony Noel, Leonora O'Sullivan, Benjamin O'Fori, Nana O'Kay, Joshua Ofer, Henry Oriana Del Cid, Kayla Ortiz, Veronica Osman, Kai Uk, Miguel Ovale, Daniela Ovale Coronado, Andrew Owens, Catherine Owens, Silas Colton Parker, William Parker, Quarry Patterson Bell, Adnan Pellick, Justin Perdue, Georgette Perez, Yasmin Phillips, Eric Pierce, Ethan Pitts, Kaylee Poe, William Porter, Kelly Pasta, Asha Pradhan, Lisa Kwok, Rule Kudus, Edi Kui Shali, Goshan Rafi, Yoni Ramirez, Perla Ramos Perez, Zoe Randall, Ahmad Razuli, Jasmine Rich, Mario Richardson, Gilbert Rios, Hallie Robertson, Devin Robinson, Isaiah Robinson, Leandra Robinson, Malik Robinson, Sonia Robinson, Mara Carmen Roca Rodriguez, Julian Rogers, Wendell Rodriguez Camacho, Jesus Roland, Calais Ross, Zenovia Russell, Jonathan Saviston, Heba Sala, Diana Salazar Trexler, Antonio Salazar Trexler, Diana Sanchez, Chandra Sarki, Malachi Satchel, Madeline Schwetzi, Amari Settle, Amani Shabazz, Cameron Shaliva, Nasir Shelton, Savannah Shepard, Alvin Dan Shisoka, Viani Shorts, Xavier Simmons, Rashawn Sims, Trayvon Sims, Joseph Simpkins, Desiree Sims, Taylor Skorupa, Anaya Smith, Brandon Smith, Christian Smith, Elijah Smith, Caitlin Smith, Charles Smith, Alexis Sneed, Hazel Snyder, Kira Stallworth, Michaela Steinmark, Katarina Stevenson, Kyle Stevenson, Jenna Stern, Christian Stewart Mayundo, Tatiana Stills, Maya Stith, Joseph Stockton, Imari Stone, Nicholas Stewart, Joshua Sykes, David Ta, Alex Tanner, Umar Tariq, Amia Taylor, Bryson Taylor, Callie Taylor, Christopher Taylor, Davis Taylor, Khadijah Thomas, Sky Thompson, Anaya Tillery, William Timay, Manuka Timsina, 
David Tolsis, Emmanuel Torres, Moniqua Towns, Christopher Townsend, Nicholas Trala, Noah Trala, Isaiah Truman, Shane Tunstall, Reed Tutwaller, Camille Tyler, Jocelyn Tyler, Fatima Valadez, Monica Valdez Castaneda, Jalen Vance, Joaquin Vargas, Rayanigo Vasquez Bowens, Christian Velasquez, Diego Vincera, Serenity Vong, Ariel Wadi, Tyler Wade, Michaela Walker, Tracy Wanyoke, Jayshawn Warren, Chaz Washington, Tashai Washington, Austin Waters, Brandon Watson, Anna Worsbale, Justin Michael Whitaker, Chloe White, Mia White, Landon Jalen White, Tyarn White, Javante Antonio Whiters, Demetric Wiggins, Abigail Wilhelm, Al Karan Talik Williams, Amir Williams, Jalen Williams, Cameron Williams, Elizabeth Wilson, Justin Wolf, Morgan Womack, Catherine Wood, Ian Wright, Kiana Wright, Kirsten Wright, Prince Yeboa, Ramika Young, Michaela Zacharias. And congratulations to the Hermitage High Class of 2020. Congratulations to the Class of 2020, the unbreakable Class of 2020. Go make us proud. Roll Pride.